I want to give life to children who have been abandoned and who are suffering without any sin or fault committed by them. Meet Chennai Solomon Raj, the proud appa of 42 HIV positive kids abandoned by their relatives. Solomon and his wife Felvia Shanti first thought of adopting when they did not have any kids for 8 years after their marriage in 1992. Me and my wife were very clear that if at all we want to adopt somebody, it must be a very deserving child, an unwanted child who has been abandoned by the family and the society. And those days, HIV uh, positive children were the most uh, uh, unwanted children because of the lack of uh, information, because of the lack of awareness programs and misconceptions by the society, these children were unwanted children. So we want to adopt these children and give them life. Year after year, Solomon kept searching for that one child. But meanwhile, unexpectedly, the couple was blessed with their own biological child and adoption took a back seat. Until one day, when Solomon get a call from a trans woman, Nuri. All of a sudden, one day, a trans woman called me and said, Solomon, I just have a child who is HIV positive. Her mother has passed away. Will you be able to take this child and give life to that child in your home? After hours of discussion with his wife and family, he made his choice. And Solomon did not make that choice only once. Ultimately, he repeated it 42 more times. After Solomon adopted the first HIV positive child, the word spread and requests for adoption increased day by day. 17 years later, he is a father to 43 HIV positive children. Seven of whom are college students. And it was very difficult for me to financially take care of these children. So I started working in two, three different places to earn income for the family. But the joy of 43 children calling me Appa is the most uh, joyous and very priceless uh, thing that I have ever felt in my life. Today Solomon runs Shelter Trust where he is assisted by women staff who are also HIV positive. I hope that the misconception, the stigma, the discrimination will fade off from these children and all these children will have a happy and a joyful life in their future. Together, they all work tirelessly to ensure that the kids never fall short of food, medicines, education and most importantly, love. If you like to contribute to the journey of Solomon, contact him at 0944445275. For more such inspiring stories, keep watching The Better India.